2160, I Alien Memoirs of a UFO Spy Author Tony Topping President Hunter McKinley Address to Scouts Information Center May I thank Admiral McKees Commander of Special Contact Operation Very C, the Very C Agency, for allowing me to visit today. I feel her nickname of Admiral Unflappable is apt. Oh, and by the way, I presented her with the punch bag she wanted. She kept forgetting to order it. But Team McKinley, to the rescue. I also thank Commander Isha Gardaminian of the Nordic Exploration Command, Andromeda Sector whose stories are legendary. What makes me stand back in awe is the exchange of real-time information across a network that links us to another galaxy. It is the Nordic we have to thank for their scientific liaison and security protection. I understand our exploration team were up against the Nordics, we taught them baseball, and I laugh at how an advanced civilization in another galaxy occupies itself with our nation's great sport. As your commander-in-chief, I stand before you, for all mankind, as leader of the free world. On this day we also honor those of the past who helped build the joint alien-human information highway we know today called Hypernova. I have at night laid awake thinking of the horrors and struggle the early human biological information servers went through. As your president the burden of this will forever be on my mind. Individuals from yesteryear gave their hearts and souls into the service of humanity. Some did not even know, as it was covert. But one man was smart enough to work it all out in a most unique way. It was this man, who kept telling us, to open our communication channels. In a book he wrote, that first nobody took any notice of. Yet our alien allies were continually making hints to us, back in yesteryear. I read the book I Alien Memoirs of a UFO Spy. The author was subjected to continual abuse and a terrible childhood. Yet still he was chosen, his faith in God, and the birthing of the concept of hypernova came from his book written in yesteryear 2023. It moved me to tears, as it will every freedom-loving individual. The author O.T. this book. Tony Topping the creator of this concept will as he dreams, see the downlink of us gathered today. Those who read his book may see it as fiction. But of course, what you are reading is a book that is a jigsaw piece of a unique time travel artifact. To you Tony Topping, codename Loftus Gate we say thank you. The brave men and women who were bioinformation servers of yesteryear are among the pioneers of this cosmic intranet and have shown bravery and honor. Today, we look back with gratitude to their contributions. Uncommon among uncommon people. Never would they know that their sacrifice gave way to our place in a wider galactic community. For future generations, I am in awe, not only of their courage, but also the way they have uniquely served humanity. They shall be never forgotten. We now live in age, when humanity has realized that war is an act of stupidity. And our real enemy is nature. How we shamefully polluted this earth for the sake of consumerism is a shocking legacy. For the children of future earth. For we listen to those of the star nations. America rolled the dice. To mesh our knowledge in democratic freedoms. What we thought was invasion by alien forces. Was in fact an opening of communication channels. It is an uncertain multiverse and our military forces must always be on guard. Our great nation has learned, and learned the hard way, in the process of this work, it saved countless lives. I am the proudest man on earth to be your president. Let us move forward into the wider galactic community. I am proud my administration achieved what was thought to be the impossible. Hypernova is the network of today. Not tomorrow. God bless America.